Well, welcome yeah. to the Moving Picture Studio yeah. in Toronto, Josh Hartnett, Guy Mosher. Uh, firstly, congratulations on the film's, you know, thunderous reception. Um, what was it like, Guy, for you to, to have something that was so clearly constructed, a whole world constructed your own personal playset, have it play out to an audience? Um, it's fun. I mean, it's kind of a liberating feeling, actually. It's like giving birth or something, you know? It just it ceases to be yours. You just look around. You kind of you, you get nervous for the first 15 minutes, like you think the sound is not playing right or something is wrong or whatever. And then you just let go, you know. When the laughter starts coming, it's really nice. It's like, you know, it liberates you gradually. And by the end, I was out of it. I was like, this is their movie. Now, if they like it, they like it. If they don't, they don't. There's nothing I can do. Josh, for you, uh, you know, straight after the film, you said it's, you know, a lot to process, yeah. given that it was the first time you'd seen it. Um, and uh, have you had some more time to kind of think about it and, and kind of put it, because I mean, most of the time you were probably working with a green screen and not really fully appreciative of the vision. Well, the thing about it? the, the thing, uh, well, thank you for putting my appreciation levels at that, <laughs> so, uh, at such a low level. Uh, <laughs> yeah, no, I, imagination. <laughs> yeah, my imagination is, uh, I don't have one. I, uh, you know, we talked a lot about the visuals beforehand and it, what you don't, I mean, you might not see on screen, uh, but I think is kind of evident if you really know about it, is that a lot of the sets were physical. And uh, it's just the kind of uh, the sky, or sometimes the extension of the uh, of the city that wasn't there. So it's it was it wasn't like working on Sin City where there was nothing, you know. And Robert put everything in afterward. This was like there were physical sets that we got to interact with, which is great. It was a conversation about how this film was going to turn out. So I had a really in it that conversation extended all the way through production. So I had a really good sense of how the movie was going to what it was going to be like. Except I didn't know what the pacing was going to be like. I didn't know that there were a few added special effects, sound effects especially, mm -hmm. that I think really amped it up and gave it this kind of, I don't know, this buoyancy. It just, it, it had pace, it had structure, it was, it was, it was funny. And I, I guess I, I don't know, I just kind of got drawn in by the audience's reaction. And for me to go up right afterward and have to talk about it, I just didn't know what to say.